How long? You know, that's really not a question that I'm asking as I think about what's happening here in the West Wing of the church. It is amazing how fast Alex and his co-worker Joshua are making progress on our counseling center. Over here we have the faith room that's divided into two rooms, so two different meeting rooms. One will be primarily for the church and the other will be primarily for the counseling center, group counseling. There is a doorway here that will provide some privacy to our clients who are coming into the counseling center when things are going on in the grace room. And then over here is the counseling center itself walking into the uh, waiting room and this is the only time that I'm really saying how long must we put up with Alex's choice of music. It won't be long, I promise. He's doing a great job. God bless you, Alex. Thank you for all your work. But you know, as we come on in, you can see that the counseling rooms are just about finished. Here's the second counseling room. And oh, there's Joshua, our, another co-worker working over here. Thanks, Joshua. And then in here is the family counseling center. So just, just a little bit larger room for maybe a family setting. And uh, the reason why I'm joking about how long is because it's in this place that I would expect God's people are going to ask over and over again, how long? You see, our Old Testament lesson for today begins with Psalm 13 and continues through Psalm 18. And the psalmist cries out, how long, O Lord, will you forget me forever? And I think there's a lot of times when we as God's children cry out, how long? I just don't understand. How long is this going to go on? And I'm excited that here, as we build out this counseling center, there will be a place where Christians can safely come and just ask the question, how long? How is this going to all work out? And fellow Christians, counselors, can help them through. And that's part of what the, the New Testament lesson is too. In Luke 16, beginning at verse 19, and we'll read through chapter 17, verse 10, Jesus tells the story about the rich man, poor Lazarus. You know, and, and I have to think that poor Lazarus must have cried out sometimes, how long? And as Christians, we have a perspective that we know that there is an eternity prepared for us. And, and the account of the rich man and poor Lazarus reminds us and reassures us. But in the meantime, it is so hard. Hard to, to deal with the pain that we go through. Hard to forgive others. And so the lesson ends in chapter 17, 1 through 10 with the disciples asking Jesus, you know, increase our faith. And to me, that's what this counseling center is all about. That God's people can safely say, how long, Lord? I'm in pain. I hurt. Fellow Christians can understand them, listen to them, help them find God's answers. And through the Holy Spirit, answer their prayer. Lord Jesus, increase our faith. God grant that answer to each of us today.